The case was the priority of the Libyan government. Zuetina oil terminal should reopen in the coming days after protesters forced operations to shut down last December. The 2,500 employees of the facility were demanding better work conditions. Negotiations are still ongoing, but authorities are urging for activities to resume. We received information from the administration saying that the organization has decided to restart operations and oil pumping at the Zuetina terminal. Maybe in a day or two, we will restart operations. However, Zuetina Harbour plays a minor role in exports with roughly 60,000 barrels of crude oil per day. The daily oil production in Libya is 22 times higher than Zuetina production. It's a facility of average capacity compared to Sidra, Brega and Ras Lanouf. The three refineries were also hit by strikes in July last year. At the time, the government had to reduce oil production by 20%. Oil installations have become a major focal point for protests against the new regime. In Zuetina's case, the stakes are less important, but pressure remains high. 90% of government revenues rely on oil industry. Production has almost reached its pre-war level. Now, the government wants to prove the country is stable again. The restoration of order at the Zuetina facility must be a symbol of the end of the political turmoil.